Hey everybody, welcome to another episode from Fear in Peak Gaming. I've been doing some thinking on the name, and it's between People's Gaming and Fear in Peak Gaming. So for now, I'm just going to stick with Fear in Peak Gaming. Anyways, let's take a look at all of the new Pokemon goodies I've gotten over the past few days. Over here on the right, I have these three awesome Pokemon booster boxes. As you can see, this first one here is from the X and Y series, Roaring Skies. I'm really excited about this box. Uh, I didn't get to open many cards from the X and Y series. And so I'm going to open this for you guys in, in a future video. It won't be this video, but we will get to that. I have two Sword and Shield Darkness Ablaze boxes, booster boxes, that I'm going to open for you guys in later videos as well. On this one here, though, I ordered it directly from Amazon. And when I got it, as you can see, the seal has been messed with. or It could have been done in the shipping. I don't know. We will find out when we open this bad boy up. I'm hoping, though, that they have not done any package, any anything with the boosters, switched them out or anything like that. I know that's... It's a shameful thing they do, people, some people do, when they switch out the booster packs or, or weigh them to try to get the better packs. Uh, and let's just hope that's not the case here. And I have another one right here of the same, the Sword and the Shield Darkness Ablaze. Um, I'm really hoping to get some nice Charizard pools. and We'll see, maybe some Ultra Rares, Secret Rares. Hopefully something good out of that. And, uh, let's see. I have uh, a couple of the... X and Y Evolution Packs. I've ordered some. I got some on their way now. I'm trying to get quite a few of these. I'm going to order some more as well. Hoping to get one of the big three pools uh, and some of the other really nice cards out of this pack. They're a little bit more expensive right now. And they'll probably just get more expensive as time goes on. But I got some of those coming and I will open those in a future video as well. Uh, while I was in Walmart, I actually found these new Pokemon Collector Tins. It looks like there's five per the series. It looks like five different characters on each, five different Pokemon on each. They come with two booster packs and a metallic Pokemon coin. So I'm going to be opening these up as well in a different video. It will not be this one, but I got five of this series, as you can see. And I'll go over those in more detail on a future video. And then I see these ones as well. And there's five for this this series as well. Uh, they also come with two Pokemon booster packs and a metallic gold coin. Or a metallic Pokemon coin, my bad. And then over here you can see I've, I got this Pikachu plushie. They, they come out of these Halloween kits I have here. I went ahead and bought two more. It's all I had. And we're going to open these up, and I'm going to try to get these other two Pikachus. This one was actually not premiered on the box. I need to go online and see how many different ones there are. But it also comes with two packs of Pokemon cards and another coin. So that's pretty cool. We're going to open those up on a future video as well. But for this video, I have came across these, these smaller packs of cards. I have these just three cards in them. And I went ahead and grabbed six of these. Just I wanted to open them up and see if we can get good cards out of these or not. I don't actually know. I'm going to find out. Maybe if I can get good hollows or if they have the same cards that you could get out of a full-size booster pack. That's awesome. I might grab some more and do those in another uh, a future video as well. Um, I got six of those. We will be opening those up. And then I also... Grab this Pikachu box, this Pikachu GX EVGX special collection box. It comes with <clears throat> uh, the big Pikachu card and a couple in the front. It looks like there's actually, no, this one does not have any extra cards behind it. Uh, it looks like maybe four booster packs. I am not sure. We will find out because we're going to be, yes, it is four, four of the four of the booster packs. So we are going to be opening this up this video as well. And as I've stated before in my previous videos, my first goal, I want to get to 100 subscribers. Once I do that, I will post a video and I will ask you to comment, like the video, and I will be doing a giveaway. I'm going to get 
just two booster packs. I might, I might do four. I don't know. I, I haven't decided fully, but I'm, I'm for sure going to at least buy two booster packs, and I will uh, select a random person that, that gave a comment, and I will contact you, and I will mail you a booster pack. That's just something I'd like to do. I'm just getting started out on my channel, and you know, anything I can do to make it more amusing and help people out, that's exactly what I want to do. We're just here to have fun and see if we can't get some awesome Pokemon cards or Pokemon merchandise. So, what I think we will do, let's just go ahead and dive into these these little three card packs and let's just see what, what's in them. Let's see if we can get anything good out of them or not. So, we will go ahead and start here with this first one. The Sun and Moon Unbroken Bonds. And as you can see, a bell sprout there. And it looks like I got a bell sprout, a diglet, and an energy. So not much in that. Let's go ahead and just keep going here. I would like to pull something out of these because it's kind of interesting. I mean, to see if you can, but we'll see. I got an interesting looking Oddish, a Weeper, and an Energy Spinner in this one. It looks like these are all from the Unbroken Bonds, Sun and Moon. Okay, we got a Krabby, Tangela, and another Energy. Nothing so good so far. I may have to get a couple more just to see if anything good does come in these. <clears throat> Okay, we have another common polywag, a Rhyhorn, and a Togetic, uncommon. Nothing yet. I got a Litten, first card. An Arbok, which is a rare, or oh, it's, it's, it's not non hollow. And a triple acceleration energy uncommon. We got one more pack here. Well, at least we know we can get unholographic rares in here. Let's see if we can get any hollows. I, I, I will pick up some more tomorrow, just and add them into a video and 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 try because I am curious if maybe I just got a couple bad packs, nothing great. Um, if you guys have any information on that, just uh, send me a comment if you would. Sparrow, Rick Tongue, and a Glissador. Uncommon. And that is it for those. So nothing so great. Still, I got some cards that I do not have since I'm just now restarting my collection. <clears throat> so now we will go ahead and move forward to the Pikachu and Eevee GX Special Collection Box. Let's see what we got here. It looks like it has to be open from the side, so let's do that. This thing does not want to come open at all. Let's see if we can pull this out real nice and easy. Set this box to the side. Move these back just a bit. And let's see, no tape. So I guess I don't have to get my big boy scissors out. Take that easily. Uh, it is disappointing on how they do these cards on these. A lot of times when you get them, I've noticed that they sometimes they're just they're damaged or bent up. I mean, I know they're promo cards, and I can't say that they have much of a value. But anyway, if you're a collector, you like your cards to be in good condition. So let's grab these out. And we'll take a closer look. They got them in there good. There we go. That feels awesome. I love, I, I like, uh, I really enjoy some of these new foil or hollows. 
let's see what we got here. We got this Eevee, which has my favorite, one of my favorite holographic backgrounds to it. Let's see if I can get this where it needs to be here. There we go. I I like the hollows like that. It, it, it's overall it's a good looking card. It's got it looks like it's got Eevee, uh, Rhyhorn, um, Tyrogue, I think. Either way, not bad. Not bad. Then we have this Eevee here, which is actually a beautiful card. It's got that really cool foil. Find the sweet spot here on the camera for the focus. It's a good looking card. Okay. Then we got the Pikachu full art. It's actually another cool looking card. Okay. And then we got this other Pikachu, which has that really nice hollow background. And these are all promo cards as well. All right, then we get the big Pikachu card here, which are pretty cool. I've actually got another one in that binder in the background. And it has a couple of my cards that I will be showing um, from that I have found from my previous collection. I have not been able to find all of those yet. Hopefully I can come across. I used to have a whole bunch of all the big three. So hopefully I can find some of those. <clears throat> Let me let you guys scan this here real quick. All right, let's get straight into these last couple booster packs. Looks like we got a Sun and Moon Cosmic Eclipse. Oh, nice, an Evolutions pack. I might save that, actually, for when I do the Evolutions opening. Sorry about that. We got the Sun and Moon Unified Minds and the Cosmic Eclipse again, Sun and Moon. So, let's see. Let's do this last, do this first. I wasn't a big fan of either of those two Pokemon, so let's do this one first. And it came right open. Let's see, I think it is five. Okay, let's see what we got. Copying, nose pass. Oh. Reverse hollow. Dragonian Z. Energy. Clay trainer. Pimp Love. And let's hope for something good. And we got a non hollow. That's all right. Still a cool card. All right, let's start with the Blastoise Pimp, uh, Pimp Love Pack. I actually have that card, GX. Oh, let's see what we get this time. I look like I've seen something nice in the back. We got an Eevee. Let's see if I can't get these a little better. Sneasel. Not two. Trap Pinch. Reverse Hollow. Oops. Reverse Hollow Sneasel. Torkoal. And whoa, that is a nice one. That might actually be a. Super rare. Look at the art on that. I am kind of surprised I actually got that. Not bad at all. So now I have the other Blastoise and Piplup GX card. I have them both now. It's in great condition from the front here. No, the back. This card's in amazing condition. Not a single error on this card that I can see at all. That is really nice. Let's get this in case right away. If I can figure out how to make the case work. 
I got a lot of my good cards in these cases that I picked up, and it kind of dulls out the shine, but that's okay for now. And we'll go ahead and stick it in one of these just for safekeeping until I get it put away. Pretty awesome. That 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 is nice. I enjoy that. Set that up right here. All right, last pack. Let's hope for some good last pack magic here. I wouldn't mind the Mewtwo Mew if that's a card. Let's find out. Maybe I'll get it. I have done my research on the new Sword and Shield Darkness of Blaze, so I do know the cards that come in those packs. I have not done it for every single pack yet. I will as soon as I get the time to do it. That way I know exactly. Okay. I'm actually a little excited about this one too. All these cards look nice. Let's hope it was something just as nice as that last one. Carablast, Fletchling. I don't think I did the trick right, guys. Hone Edge. Oh, sweet. Look at that Pikachu. That is awesome. Hoot Hoot. With the Zapdos in the background. Reverse Hollow, Yanma. Energy. Let's see here what we're going to get. Trainer Chandler. Hazel. And a Licky Licky. Non Hollow. Still a nice card, though. All right. Um. Just a quick overview here of some of the cards that I actually kept out here. Well, we got the Pikachu, the ones that came with the pack. And that, that Eevee. I like that Eevee and that Pikachu. Then we got that Blastoise card there. Um, I will show you guys real fast before I end this video. <clears throat> Let's see. Uh, I can find it. Set that down real easy. I have this one as well. So now we have the pair. That is, let's see what that value's at. And maybe even get that rated if it's nice enough. But pretty awesome, huh? Well, I'm excited. And I'm very excited to get some of these other cards opened, especially now that I got a nice pool. So, if you if you enjoyed this video, if you would, just please hit the like button, subscribe, help me get this channel started. I have a lot down the pipeline for you guys. Um, not only Pokemon cards, I will have game videos. Um, and if you if your audience, you know, if you have young kids, um, me and my daughter, she will be making some slime. And doing some other cool things that I have ready. Uh, in, in future videos. So, if you would just do me that favor. If you liked it, leave a comment. And until next time.